Silky Johnson, welcome to the video. Also, welcome to all of you. YouTube, I'm back. It feels weird. I'm just sitting here, no chat. Just, just talking to myself like I used to do all the time. We'll see how this goes. Uh, today we have a Wiccan deck that I don't know if I, I believe it's going to be good. This is from Jeff Hoagland. <gasps> um, at the end of the video, I'm going to include a loss that was maybe the most unfortunate loss that I've ever experienced. Um, and it's, it's not... Oh, dude, we kind of want to rock. It's not really clickbait. Um, I hit... Well, just watch it. You'll see. It was very not fun. If we don't get Wiccan now, I think we're uh, absolutely toasted. Well, junk. <clears throat> no? Okay. Dude, are you freaking nuts, man? <laughs> I've played Wiccan on Vore once. Ugh. This stuff drives me crazy sometimes. Here comes Wicked, though. No. Yep. <sighs> I'm really... I'm pretty tired of Loki existing in this game in general at this point. Every... Experience feels exactly the same all the time. It's not even that, though. Like, Loki just seems like it ends up drawing better than I could ever draw in my wildest dreams. All the time. You know what, though? This, this. This feels interesting. I don't know if it wins. But we're... Oh, probably not. Because Loki still reduces cost. What am I doing? Actually, it's not as bad as I thought it was going to be. Uh, in fact, it's better than we could have ever imagined. Yes. Victory. I've had such, I've had such bad luck today. Holy cow! This is the third game. Oh man! All right. Okay. Uh, this is interesting. I one of the things that I forgot was whether Loki copied. You know, the high Evo version or not. It doesn't. We're good. This was min-maxed quite well. I'm proud. <sighs> anyway, I can't even remember if I said it, but uh, I got this from Jeff Hoagland. And um, it, it works fine. My go-to for cards is usually high Evo decks. I like the flow of them. Wiccan into a high Evo deck seems odd to me, which is why I wanted to try it. My a card that requires you to play all your... Oh, no. I literally can't do it. Opponent snapped. I can Arish him. A card that requires you to play out all your energy seems weird to me to have Wiccan in there. And now when it's literally impossible, I don't, I don't really know how to handle that situation. But like we found out, 4-7 slash 3-7, pretty good stat line. Can't complain about that one too much. All we needed was a card that cost one energy. Ah, that's fine. Marble Boy. 
just to get some stuff pumping seems good. Wiccan is already ruined. Dude. Do people know how to play anything other than Loki? Is everyone okay right now? Dude. Oh my gosh. All right. Whatever. It's fine. Keep playing your cards mid. <laughs> it's Arishim Loki. <sighs> playing out Arishim is quite a choice. Arishim Loki with Elysium, Castle Blackstone, and Super Flow. <laughs> I just, I have this feeling that we might be in some trouble. <laughs> they already snapped on us, so whatever. Best draws of all time for them. I like it. Yeah, things are things are just weird. It's nice to be back kind of in a different flow. I love streaming, like a lot. It's just a stressful thing to do sometimes. Um, it's tough right now because School. This is this is the first week of classes. I'm trying to figure out a new groove for getting content out. We'll see how things go. So I like this only because it it they already have such a crazy lead when it comes to energy. I don't even know if it matters if we try to stifle them. I don't know. I don't know if it'll do anything. There's no way they used all their energy all game. Come on. Just let me play something. There's, there's not much you can do against that. They, they had everything that they wanted from start to finish of that game. Oh, man. I don't know. I don't know what to say. It's fine. My spirits aren't down. It doesn't... I'm already at infinite. It doesn't matter. I'd love to get back to top 1k. With school being a thing now, though, I don't know. We'll have to find out. Okay. Well, it looks like we're not going to get to play Wick in this game either. Ooh. It looks like we will get to play Wick in this game. It, which feels... It's Arashim. It feels like a snap condition, but if it's Arashim, not a snap condition. Domino. I like I like that Domino's getting all this play now. It's nice. Made by Arashim. They red bordered their Arashim. Nice. Look at these monsters. So snapping right now makes some amount of sense, I'll say. But with it being Arashim. Have I said Arashim enough? I don't know. This is a Shang-Chi target now, and I like that. We have Snow Guard. What'd you get? Dude, it's freaking Namora all over the place. They took my She-Hulk. Okay. So now it's up to us whether we actually want to snow guard Hawk or not.
Playing Snowguard Hawk probably just loses us the game. But I like the idea that we could do it as fear. So they'll probably play out their Odin, but also move vision. That's my current guess. Really? Please give me she -Hulk. They have my She-Hulk, so it doesn't matter. I don't know, man. There's something that just feels wrong about this whole deck to me right now. They could just move the vision... And they're fine. I'm playing Snowguard Bear just because it's more power. There's just, there's something that feels off. Oh. Dude, your freaking fart doesn't solve your problem. I kind of forgot we were playing. Oh, and that dude's almost top 1k. All right, so it's not a bad showing of the deck. I just, I don't know what to do when their deck works and my deck doesn't. You know, it's, it's a little bit tough. I feel like this is a deck. I think the video that I was watching of Hoagland, oh, I have it up still, an hour and a half long. And so maybe to get a good feel for the deck, you got to just play it a little longer than I have time for, but well, I don't have time for it. All right, so we can't play Wiccan again. You know what? There's no point. You know, I guess technically there was a point. Cerebro 2. Which, if we can get things to work out, should be fine. I don't want to see Wiccan at all this game. Please, just leave me alone. So this is a weird thought, but I want them to commit something to Asgard. Oh, okay. Not Cerebro 2. It does make that play look a little bit weird. <laughs> but that's fine. I was hoping to Cyclops them because you can't have Luke Cage and a Cerebro 2 at this point. So we're going to commit some power left. Again, 3-7 stat line for Wiccan. It's not really what it is, but it is this game and quite a few other ones. That's really, really good. Sunspot probably would have been the most ideal one drop for us to have. Soaking makes sense. But without Sunspot, it doesn't matter too much. So Sunspot and Kyra are the cards that are on the bottom of our deck. I feel like this makes the most sense. Onslaught is my assumption. Then Onslaught into what? Like Ms. Marvel? I don't know. And because we didn't get Wiccan out, we're in a tiny bit of a pickle. We're not... We're not going to win mid. 
but like the power that we can output is very odd and pretty lopsided. Maybe they just play Mystique mid? Called it. Okay. Left. I need more left. They have 832 mid? <laughs> Sometimes numbers are just more fun to see happen than winning. Now, if you're watching this video to find a deck to play, please know most people's luck is better than my luck. This is not how the deck performs for everybody. This is how the deck performs for me. I believe I'm, it, it appears that I'm playing this on some Elysium hotspot day. I don't know. That might not be true. But again, it could just be really dumb luck. Overall, I feel like this deck is really cool. A lot of it is going to depend on how much you find yourself running into RSM, all of that nonsense. Can you draw what you need to lay what you need to to get Wicked to work? Because if you can, sweet. Can we? We need to draw either Marvel Boy, Kyra, or Cyclops next turn. They drew their Psylocke on two. We'll draw one, uh, a one cost. Oh. Okay. We're going to get Wiccan out. They're going to get Wiccan out. So this could be the Mr. Negative-esque deck. But you just get rid of Mr. Negative and put Wiccan in there. I am I am clogging all of my lanes. I'm not going to snap. Sunspot would be ideal to hit right now. Dude, their luck is so good. This is amazing for them. Sunspot, please. I just want one. <laughs> I just want one sunspot. I mean, we might as well do this. What's happening today? I just wanted to play something fun. And everyone is playing clog Arashem Loki kick your butt for no fun decks. <sighs> Maybe this would have been a good day to just eat breakfast and not make a video. <laughs> Holy cow. I'll I will attempt to play a couple more games. But I'm I'm just I'm going to be honest if this is what the meta is. Like I've been out of this for like a week and a half. If this is the meta. Always lucky. No. Like, I don't I don't want to do this. Give me Wiccan. Please, please don't mess me over. If Mirror Dimension ends up being Castle Blackstone, this is a beautiful play. 
If not, we're in some trouble. Oh, it's just, it's, it's just more clog. Okay. All right. We don't technically need Wiccan at this point. Knowing that we're probably about to get our butts kicked. This is what we're doing. Sunspot, I don't know. I don't know where you are. I don't know what I've done to deserve to not be able to hang out with you. But I, I miss, I miss you and what you add to decks like this. Yeah, doesn't really matter though, does it? Annihilus. Again, we're in the same exact boat. Dude, they got an eye What's up? <laughs> oh my gosh. This is a 1-9 or a 5-10. <sighs> Shang-Chi right. Oh. Cool. got one more for you one more game and then I will include my most unfortunate experience of the morning that I don't I feel like this is dumb luck that I'm winning at this point and that is horrifying to me but I gotta get to work so if you made it this far and you enjoyed watching me get my butt kicked make annoyed sad sounds complain about RSM if you agree about any of that let me know in the comments below Hit the like button. If my face annoys you, feel free to hit the dislike button. That's okay too. I'm not I'm not really that <laughs> Oh come on. We can't <laughs> I knew I knew this was what my morning was gonna look like. I knew I would I would play Wiccan a time. Is this the worst Cerebro 3 deck that's ever existed? <sighs> this is why I'm afraid to play new cards. Especially ones that have as strict of a play line as this one does. And so my, my original thought with it was don't don't play just for lines using, you know, Wiccan. Just put it into a deck. If it happens, it makes your deck better. If it doesn't happen, it's fine. It's not a big deal. That's how I feel like I should have played. Um, I don't... Maybe, maybe this... Don't understand playing out. Are they playing Agatha?
So we have a 411 and a 410. If we play Squirrel Girl, it locks us in right. Why are they snapping? Like, I don't really understand what their deck is anyway. Okay, so it looks like I need Kyera. Huh. I'm really sad right now, but it's the last game. I'm going to play it out. But they're just, they're going to play Killmonger and win. There are a lot of times that I don't understand what a deck is. I've never seen this deck before in my life. All I can say right now is if you made it this far in the video, thanks so much for watching. I appreciate it. Make good choices. Remember, you're going to have a great day whether you know it or not. And as always, don't play decks that I say are good because my luck is bad. And don't play decks that or don't don't play decks just because I suck at them because my luck is worse than the average bear. So I'll give this a shot later. I'll keep playing it for the day. I'll report back later on whether or not I think that this is worth your time. If Jeff Hoagland can play it and it says it's good, sweet. Also, enjoy this very unfortunate retreat later moment. I'll see you tomorrow. <sighs> this was my good. There's four one drops in here. I should be able to find one. If so, just looking at the deck, having Snow Guard and Squirrel Girl in here, I kind of want to put in Mockingbird. I think that might be a good idea. Okay. We can do it. I just want to I just want to see the animation just once. I just want to see something cool happen once. Remember the echo is mid. Always <laughs> lucky. If they keep playing uh oh, their name is Chin Pokemon. Nice. I'm not worried about you, Jeff. Oh my gosh. What is going on here? All right. I just need to see Wiccan now. Uh, no, well, we're doing it. <gasps> okay this is good and then we just soak for forever unless it's professor x oh boy just full soak Full soak. Good. <laughs> I don't want to lose. Oh my gosh. We would end up playing against a Namora deck. Well, we saw the animation. I don't know if it's worth losing eight cubes over. So the right location is going to be pretty big. They're going to move Jeffrey. 
I just I don't know if moving Jeff mid makes someone is drumming behind me. I believe my son just woke up. Um let's do this. What? No! No! 